Camera B speeding, camera A speeding. Okay. All right. You're the Matrix. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Lisa Ray's interview, call time, take three. But what was so funny about doing Martin is I didn't know what I was going to have to do. And being on that set for all those many hours, I was like, I don't ever want to do this again. I'm cool. And then <laughs> you called me way. again for um, LL's show. Yes. Um, in the house. In the house. But and I had a bump up role. I was speaking at that time. That's good. But even before that, do you remember the video after we did Martin? Like a, one of the guys that was at the Martin show in the audience came up to me and said, excuse me, you know, you have, because I had you in a lot of, it was a party scene I actually had right. going on too. Mm -hmm. And he was like, I'm doing an audition for a music video. Can you invite some of the, some of the girls by, and especially that young lady right there. Speaking of you, Lisa Ray. That's that star part. Yeah. And so um, that video, <laughs> that artist's name was Teddy. Um, right, 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 right. I the video never that. came out though, and I think because yeah. of his name, but the, the song was okay. Yeah. But I just, I don't know why the video ever came, but at the video was a producer. Carl Craig. Exactly. And Carl Craig. Dead Players Club. There See it is. how it comes back around? Well, go around, come back around. That is important because you never know the person that is right in front of you may be able to take you to your next ride. Mm -hmm. And that was you. See? Well. Because I did a video with Carl Craig too. And then that's when I got the audition for Players Club. And he stood up in that audition and said, I've worked with this young lady. Her work ethic is very, uh, very good. And she's this and she's that. And I was going to sit down, sit down. <laughs> this is my first time doing a role. You know? uh -huh. <laughs> I'm not just, you know, having the camera on and I'm just moving around or whatever, you know. Um, but I don't know. It's something that you guys are trained to see in us as artists that even sometime when we don't believe, you all believe and you see something in us that will um, allow us to shine, that push, that shove, that you can do it, you can do it. And right. It's like, really, really? Okay, so, hey, you know what the heck you're doing. And, well, yep, and Carl did too. Yep. I have to say that because you did a great job in the players. Uh oh, both of y'all, huh? Yes, you do. Jeez. So, Carl, if you want to interview. I'm going to send you some champagne then, okay? Well, I don't drink no more, but you can send me some Coke or something. I don't drink no more alcohol. Um, I, don't that up. I, don't, I don't like the way that sounds. So I'm gonna Coca, bring you a, a Coca Cola. Right. Pepsi. Right, 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 right. I right. did say Coca. We are in Hollywood. You know? <laughs> That's <laughs> you know, right. Things be happening. Yeah. You know? Pepsi Cola. I'm yeah. talking about. But I do. How about dinner? That'll work. I can at least. Because I can eat. Allow me to make money, so at least I can spend ten dollars on you. Feed me one time, and I'm good. McDonald's, it is. Can I can I supersize? Man. Oh. Okay, well, I got a hit show. Yeah, okay. Extra fries. I'm getting a supersized McDonald's from Lisa <laughs> Ray. <laughs> and cut. All right.